Hello my friends, welcome to my channel. Today we're looking at Nickelodeon's um, JoJo um, set. And this is Building Blocks and we are doing a review of it today. We've already built it. There's 81 pieces in this set. Um, it definitely, um, and the only place that you can see where the stickers go are on this particular box. I already built it, so we're gonna look at here. The price point was $5. And you can see that here she is, um, this one, she's wearing a skirt, she can bend her black shoes here, uh, and then she's carrying a mic. Her head moves in this direction, she has a bow tie that's blue in this one, and her hair does come off, her head does separate, this doesn't want to at the moment, it's on there pretty tight, uh, it does come off, and then, um, and then she bends down. She has a pink skirt on. She has a black top on. And then um, she has a neon green there in the middle for her shirt. Her little doggy has a bow tie as well. But it's it's blue and it's very tiny. You, you get three of them in case you do lose them. A child will lose that for sure. It's a nice little dog. I do like that piece. I do like that piece. And then you have um, you have a bow. They all come with a bow in this and um she for her, her bow tie here and there has a couple other little bow ties on this part right here they're yellow um she had the set itself has nice purple i put some stickers on it i didn't put all the stickers i also um how the build looked on the instructions is different than how it looks here because here uh, on the box itself this piece right here is over but the instructions have this being built inward and it doesn't fit so i was like the instructions are off from what the build was and i found that really interesting because how they wanted you to build this particular piece is they wanted you to um build that over and not how i have it designed they actually probably would want you to do this That's how they would want you to build, but that's not how the instructions had it, um, how I built it. Um, but that's how they want you to build it, just like that. So, um, you have musical instrument here, like her notes for singing. Um, it has the camera here, where she's supposed to sit, but she's not going to sit on that, so that's it's kind of funny. This one, at least for playset wise, it, you can move the character around a little bit. It does have... Um, but. It's funny that they make her big enough where the door doesn't fit, where she has to duck into the door, which is something for um, other off-brands to really think about. Like, if you're going to have a doorway, make sure your character can actually walk through the doorway, not being like, a giant towards the door, which I just thought was funny. Um, or if that was supposed to be a window, it'd be better if that was a window, but it's not. Um... The set itself, um, yes, children can play with it. It's, it's wide enough for a child to play around with it. Um, the collector-wise, you, you might, if you really like JoJo, you might have a, um, put this up around. The price point was $5. I got it at a $5 store. I bought three of them. So there's three of them that I have going to have on my channel. I am going to have this playlist and the builds in a stop motion of... Um, Nickelodeon, I'm not stop motion. I will have them in a playlist called Nickelodeon Playsets, um, reviews, builds, and reviews, um, just because make it easier for you to find these and you can see how I built it and how it comes together or if there's another Nickelodeon, um, one that you're more into, um, like Rugrats. I have a one Rugrats set or Ninja Turtles or SpongeBob. We have those as well. Um, what are your thoughts on this? Do you have this? Do you have the collection? I, I would say if you're an adult, I'd pass on buying it for your collection unless you really like jojo um if you are a for a child it's it's playable definitely playable for a child um what are your thoughts let me know in the comments below thanks for watching and stay collecting